Hey guys, Denise Salcedo here with Red Carpet Report, and today we're at the Dolby Theater for Paley Fest, chatting with the cast and crew of Young Shelton and the Big Bang Theory. Yeah. Hi. Hi, Steve. How nice to meet you. I'm nice Denise. You how are well. you? I'm a big fan of the show. Oh, I so love much. the Big Bang Theory. This is like one of the shows that I'm going to be honest is that I actually follow along religiously. Really? Thank you. Yes. Okay. So what I would ask you is, you know, from the pilot until now, season 11, we've seen all the characters grow so much, and we've seen them go through so much. For you personally, what has been one of your favorite developments, character developments, or favorite storylines? I mean, I think there's been a bunch of them, and I think the, the truth is, like, I tend to remember the heartfelt parts of the story more than the, the comedy parts of the story. But obviously, like, you know, Sheldon and Amy's relationship became such a became such a big part of the show and watching the two of them together and how great they were together and watching her push Sheldon to grow as a person was huge but also the same thing watching Leonard and Penny from will they or won't they to hooking up to breaking up to getting married and now like this season you know we shot an episode where they're sort of teaming up to try to take down Sheldon as the head of the tennis association and just watching how much more comfortable they are as a married couple and how much fun they're having together like I love seeing that and and seeing Howard and Mernadette like how much Howard has changed with marriage and we, we did an episode this year where half of it was told in flashback so it gave us a chance to go back and show what these characters were like seven years ago because I think like in life they grow gradually like people do and so you don't necessarily know notice from week to week but if you go back and you look six seven years ago like they've really grown up and changed in all these special ways and it's crazy because all of their relationships are so different yeah. so now with a shaming you know we have their wedding coming <laughs> yeah. up what is going to happen? I'm expecting a lot of quirks, and I'm sure a lot of the viewers are too. Sure, and honestly, I mean, we haven't written the episode yet. We're finishing the, the one right before, but we've talked about it a lot. We've been talking about it all season long because it's important to us to get right. And, you know, so we have lots of pieces and things that we're excited about, but I think the most important thing to us is for Sheldon and to Amy to have this special day that feels very much like them. You know, yeah, it, you know, there's obviously certain people we want to have at the wedding, want to see at the wedding, but to us, this is Sheldon and Amy's special day, yeah. What about Leonard and Penny? Because I feel like right now their relationship is just like kind of there. Right. But I think the big question is, is there going to be kids in their future? <laughs> you know what? Um, well, there's a season 12 coming up. We still have episodes left to write. I mean, it's tricky on a show like ours to deal with to deal with kids, especially deal with little babies and have to have them on set. We've done pregnancy stories with the Wallowitzes now twice. So, you know, we're always trying to be careful not to repeat ourselves, but it's certainly always a part of the conversation about them and their relationship, and is that a thing that they want or is it not a thing that they want moving forward? I love it. Well, thank you so much, Steve, for talking thank to us today. Have an awesome time. Thank you. you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to give this video a like, subscribe to the channel for more, and in the comments below, let me know what is your favorite all-time moment from the Big Bang Theory.